Hey guys, how you doing? This is EJ Udo coming back again with some exciting news coming from Super 7. I told you guys I was going to keep it updated about the Silver Hawk figurines coming out from Super 7. And now we got some pictures that have been out from Super 7 on pre-order. And here we go. We're about to get right into it. Um, if you didn't check out my other video when I was talking, to, talking about Super 7 news, go check it out. Now this is the updated news. Now we got full pictures of what the figurines of the Wave 1 is going to look like. And um, they're pretty awesome. So, on that being said, Super um, Super 7 has um, released Silverhawk. I'm sorry if I said it different. Silverhawk. And I, like I said before, I remember something. I remember this cartoon. I remember watching it. Um, but I was really just into, like, the bad people. Uh, for some reason, when I was growing up, I just always liked. The, the bad people. <laughs> so, so, so I, in, so that's mostly what I was concentrating on. And, um, Super 7 has now started wave one of Silver Hawks, which is really cool. So, here is a picture of all four of them together. And we're going to break down from one each and talk about one each individually and what they come with. And, um, just a little bit more specs on them. So, so let's get right into it. So, to start it off with, from Silverhawks Ultimate Wave 1, we got Quicksilver, and he is on pre-order, and he does look really, really cool. Um, I, I, most, I like all these that have the helmet. I really just could care less about the face. I really like when they have the helmet on because it's just, it's just cool. So, he comes with an alternate head that's a helmet. He comes with a bird, actually two different birds, one with the, with the wings closed, another one with the wings open. He comes with his lasers on the side of it, and then I guess um, two um, two laser blast sparks. That, I guess that's what it is. And then he has six in total alternate hands: one with glove on, one with glove off. So that's pretty cool. And um, what and and, and he has wings um, wingspans, so you I, so you can take off his arms and uh, you know connect it. So. It's pretty cool. It's like actually getting two figurines in one. To tell you the truth, that's that's really what it it is. Um, the cost of all these are going to be well, not all these. The cost of this one is going to be fifty five dollars. And uh, just to get a little bit into the specs on what, and just to be more on point of what he comes with, the accessory he comes with is two interchangeable hands, uh, heads, eight interchangeable hands, two wing arms. Four laser effect pieces, um, hawk wrist robotic control, and um, hawk um, pitcher pose, and then another hawk um, flying pose. Okay, so that's so that's what he comes with. So that's pretty cool, and um, pretty awesome right there. So very very um, that that's very very cool. Okay, the next thing that um the the next thing that um next person we gonna talk about. Is going to be Steelheart from Silverhawks Ultimate Wave One. She is on pre-order as well. She is fifty-five dollars as well. And now she comes with three interchangeable heads. She comes with her bird has his wings out and his his wings um, folded. She comes with two wingspans, one for the left arm, another one for the right arm. She comes with her lasers and her blasters, and she comes with a total of eight hands interchangeable as well. Breaking down the the uh, breaking down everything that I just got done saying. Uh, she has three interchangeable heads, eight interchangeable hands, uh, wing arms, uh, two of those, four laser effect pieces, and she has her um, flying pose and perch pose. Okay, so um, ri uh, risers, uh, pinch pose and flying pose. I'm sorry, that's the bird. <laughs> okay. Moving on to the next from Super 7, from Silverhawks, Ultimate, Wave 1, for $55, we bring in Buzzsaw. So, <laughs> he is on pre-order. He was one of the ones that I thought was like, you know, he was cool, he was alright. I really, I mean, he was alright. Um, I did have him as a figurine, I did, I do remember him, having him as a figurine. Um, he was pretty cool. Um, he has three interchangeable heads. Um, the, I like this cartoon, but this cartoon was like very plain. And I mean, back in the eighties, I'm not gonna lie, 
And um, stay tuned for videos that I got coming up because it's going to be about the 80s. Um, these were so colorful. I mean, on just like one person. One, one, one character was always colorful. This cartoon was like, everybody was kind of like plain in like one type of coloring, I guess you would say. Like, it was like no other coloring but the coloring that you saw with them. Like, it didn't really, they didn't really reach out and make their outfits more colorful. It was just like, if they were green, they were going to be all green. And it was like, it was cool, but, I mean, it was all right. It just seemed kind of plain, though, to me. I mean, but it, it was all right. Uh, but anyway, he has three interchangeable heads. Uh, he, he has his own bird. He has a blaster. He uh, seems like he has a he has a bazooka arm. And um, I don't know what the two two hands. I'm not sure what it is, but we've got to go to the specs and see what this exactly is. So, <laughs> he has a blaster, which, okay, I was on point. He has an arm cannon. Okay. He has... Um, he has two two uh, pull handles, uh, four interchangeable heads, I mean hands, and he has four interchangeable head, uh, four interchangeable heads, hands, and three interchangeable heads. <laughs> I was going. That's kind of those get kind of tricky when they're together when you're like trying to announce it right out. So and um, so that so that's pretty cool. Now getting to my favorite character of this whole thing of the Silverhawks. The only reason why. I really just like this whole cartoon is from Wave 1 Silver uh, Hawks Ultimate, we have Armor Monstor. He was one of my favorite figurines. I wish they would have kept it like they always did. I wish Super 7, I, I knew they, they put their own little spice onto it, but I wish they would have did it where you put the, the head goes in and the other head. I wish they would have did something like that. That would have been really cool. And I just think he is awesome. Now, he is expensive. He is $85. Now, the rest of them are 7 inches. I'm about to see how big he is, but he comes with... um, uh, uh, He has uh, two... Uh, is that two or one? I'm going to read this, but I, I'm, what I'm seeing, he has two interchangeable heads. He has his bird. Everybody got a bird. <laughs> he has eight interchangeable hands. He has a blaster, and he has a store, and he has like a, a a rifle cannon or whatever it is, and um that's pretty cool. Now he stands eleven inches. That's almost twelve inches. That, that's that's a big guy. You know what I'm saying? So breaking it down, he has two interchangeable heads, ten interchangeable hands. Okay, maybe I counted wrong. Maybe I didn't see. Okay, one laser. Eye effect. Okay, that's the eye. So he has three interchangeable. He has one laser store, two elbow bo boosters, two elbow lasers, one blaster rifle, and one sky shadow. So that's the bird sky shadow. So that's pretty cool. So you guys, I just think that is really really cool that they're coming out with these silver hawks, and I think that's just really really awesome. I think I can't wait for. Um, these figurines come out because I just really want to get Monstore. That's really the only reason why. So, <laughs> so I think I think this is really cool. I I think that um, Super Seven is definitely you know bringing the kids of the '80s or 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 childhood toys back to life, and I think this is really really cool. So, thumbs up to Super Seven. Um, comment below if you guys are going to get this. Let me know. Um, I definitely will be keeping my, my my eye out for this wave one, but mostly for Monstor. Definitely will. So, on that being said, we're about to end this segment of news about Super 7. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that bell button, and I'll be back.